Hello and welcome to the new AKTF News. Hi, my name is Ryan, and along with my friend Pumpkin Chinky, we're going to give you all the updates on TVXQ and what they've been up to lately. So first, let's start with our main story today, which is JYJ. I don't know if you guys have checked out the Billboard website recently, but they did restock our JYJ magazines, considering that they did sell out of those magazines, which was really impressive. In other news, there's a new Billboard article that went about praising JYJ's new A-Girl MV, which just came out yesterday. Uh, it was a great review, so I suggest if you guys are worried about American feelings about JYJ, go check out that article. There was a great quote in there from Billboard stating and how it makes Justin Bieber jealous. And anything that hurts Justin Bieber pretty much makes me happy. In relation to that news, as I kind of previously stated before, on November 1st was the debut of A Girl MV, which uh, came with varying reviews from different people that I've spoken to on Twitter. A couple of quotes from those people stating that they thought it wouldn't pass in the American market, and some said that they didn't like it. Others said that it was amazingly awesome to see JYJ dance and that they look really sexy. No surprise, these are from Cassiopeia. So hopefully we get a more solitary view on that, and once we get to see that in the American market, we'll have more news on that. Something that I've been asked to cover quite frequently is the recent Yahoo article that was published about JYJ. Not so much the article itself that was the controversy, but the comments below it. A lot of the comments from average American viewers weren't very positive and that worried a lot of Cassiopeia. Unfortunately for me, I don't think anyone has the right to really tell them what's good and what's not. All we can do is refer them to some of the other music that they have on their album, maybe Empty or Be My Girl, or even possibly refer them to some of the news about TVXQ. Uh, to some of their videos and show them what they're really about if they weren't impressed by a girl because in honest in my honest opinion it, that song isn't in everyone's best taste in more pressing news if you haven't checked recently tickets for the American showcase of JYJ in America just went on sale recently and the ticket prices are astronomical to say the least so hopefully you girls have been saving up so that you can afford to go to this concert and see our guys dance and sing to these amazing songs unfortunately uh, I will not be able to join you for as I am going to a debate competition the same weekend that they're going to the New York show, which is the only show I'd be able to go to, so sorry about that. Moving on from JYJ, we now move on to Home In. It has just been announced and is pretty controversial that You Know has just been cast in the drama Poseidon, which is set to take place in early 2011. The real controversy lies though not in that You Know is cast, however, in his character's name, Oh Yun Jae, which is pretty close to the pairing name, Yoon Jae, who basically, along with Yusu, are the two couples of TVXQ. And so people don't know if this is kind of a mean trick on you know, just that he has to live with the fact that his beloved one isn't with him all the time, or they just think it's a funny joke. And I am pretty much undecided on that issue, considering I don't really see them together in the first place. Uh, maybe it's a guy thing. And Chong Min is modeling. As usual, he's just modeling everywhere, and he's really not doing much. Hope uh, as a last part of the news, I do want to talk about my bias. Uh, I'm not gonna say his name for the end of the video, but I will say in the video entitled "AKTF News Fan Man," in the last minute and 30 seconds of the video, I mention every member of TVXQ except for one. That member is my bias. If you figure it out, leave that comment below. Uh, in other news, I do have a question of the day. And the question of the day is, who are your top five favorite boy bands, including TBXQ? The next video, I'll be sure to tell you mine, so please leave your comments below, and I'll be sure to look at them, and we can talk about it in the next video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Bye from me. Bye from Pumpkin Shinky. I'll see you guys later. Peace.